small number additions or additions with no carrying is easy for kids but when it comes to long number additions kids find it difficult in this lesson we will learn a simple technique to make any kind of additions easy this is called dot method let me explain you this using an example let's add 568 plus 247 first add 8 and 7 it's 15 15 is 10 plus 5 write 5 in the answer and put a dot on the number 8 to indicate 10 this dot is considered as 110 add 1 to 4 that is 5 add 5 to 6 You get eleven. Eleven is one more than ten. So write one in the tens place in answer and put a dot on six to indicate ten. Now add one and two. You get three. Add three and five. That is eight. Write it in the hundreds place in the answer. So the final answer is eight hundred and fifteen. This is a simple example of dot method. Now let's use this method to add three long numbers: four hundred and fifty-three plus six hundred and twenty-eight plus two hundred and ninety-four. Let's add all the numbers in the ones place: four, eight, and three. First, add four and eight. You get twelve. Twelve is ten plus two. So put dot on eight to indicate ten, and add. Two to three, you get five. Write five in the ones place in answer. Now add all the numbers in tens place. That is nine, two, and five. Before that, see how many dots are there in the ones place. There is one dot. So first add one and nine, you get ten. Ten has one ten and zero. So put a dot on nine to indicate ten, and add zero to two. You get two. Add two to five. You get seven. Write seven in the tens place in answer. Now we'll add all the numbers in hundreds place. Two, six, and four. Before that, see how many dots are there in the tens place. There is one dot. So first add one to two to get three. Add three to six, you get nine. Add nine to four, you get thirteen. Thirteen is ten plus three. So put a dot on four to indicate ten, and write three in the hundreds place in the answer. There is one dot in the hundreds place. So write the number one in thousands place. In Every time you visit this page, you get new questions. Finish this practice exercise in.